Shooter ready. Yeah, I'm ready. Stand by. Yep. All right, pretty good, but you're, you're getting like mostly deltas. You gotta slow down, take your time, get your hits. Okay, Joe? I'll sl okay, so I'll slow down. Slow down, all right. This freaking target, dude. Shooter ready. Stand by. Joe, you're just, that was even faster. You what do you mean that down. was even faster? There's the not a single alpha down. on that target. You know what? No. Joe, it. Joe, no, Joe, Joe, leave it alone. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're doing the IWI 37 millimeter grenade. Yeah. The flare, flare launcher. Flare launcher, 37 millimeter launcher. There we go, we'll call it that. Uh, this was sent to us. We'll get this out of the way. It was sent to us along with almost all of the ammunition that we're shooting today. Yeah, it's like. By IWI. We're like we're real. We're famous now, We're right? real YouTubers. We're famous. They uh, wanted to send us this. Actual niche internet micro celebrities. Anyway, IWA, great company. We've been working with them for uh, a little bit now, actually, yeah, since since our really cool video yeah, on- Yeah, ever since uh, I got flash banged. Flash banging in the shed. We, yeah. we flash banged in the shed, so. Not, not um, flash bangs, distraction devices. Distraction devices. Distraction devices yeah. in, in the in shed. The shed. We, we did that in we the We were already the shed. flashing and banging. We were flashing and banging, so and matter. then we distraction device you guys from the flash and banging. Uh, today, we've got the ML37. So it fires smoke rounds, long range smoke. You can use it for signaling. It has uh, signal flares. This is a firework round. We're gonna get into that. Um, it has flare rounds. These are concussion. Um, and then there's, these are all like not anti-personnel, which is why you can have these. And then there's some other stuff that uh, that we're, we're not gonna talk about. Where are all these holes? Th there's yeah. nothing. Anyway, you could put anti-personnel ammo in these. Um, you have to register it with the government if you do that. Um, it's okay to own them as long as you don't put them inside the little thingy without registering it first, because that would turn it into what we call a destructive device. The advantage of this is I can have this shipped straight to my door. There's no background check required. You just order it and have it sent to your door. You can think to yourself, you know what I want? A grenade launcher or a flare, a flare launcher. launcher. And then you get it sent to your door. So this launches flares and smoke. This is made by MWT and exclusively imported by IWA International. Um, a fun fact about MWT, they make the ML40, which is an actual military grenade launcher. So this is an actual military grenade launcher that is three millimeters less so that civilians can own it. Mm. Um, you know what three I think? millimeters is a lot, boys. Three millimeters is a, a lot. lot. HR has been waiting to make that joke his so entire he's been, life. Joke, he's a, been it's itching. A statement of truth. A, sorry, his truth statement. His, he wanted to tell his truth since we started this video. Um, so we got a lot to get into today, actually. We have an absurd amount of ammo to shoot through. Thank you, IWA, for that. And then I also was online looking for some ammo, and I found some silly little goofy little funny little silly little haha -ha little boys, um, some signaling flares, and some uh, firework rounds mm -hmm. that we're going to shoot out of it. So so uh, let's get into get into it. Let's get into it. We got the long range smoke round loaded up here. Uh, IWA is gonna be selling these as well. Um, so we'll have the, they'll have those available at some point here. This is an old police issue one. Yeah, this is a uh, poli old police issue one. So we're gonna see how long it'll burn, how far it'll go, uh, smoke output, all that type of stuff. So uh, let's uh, see where Thomas is down here. All right. Oh, wait. Oh, that's a lot of smoke. Uh, anyway. So that went easily over 100 yards. This is 120-ish uh, yards? Yeah. And you were pointed at... Not I, I was far. using the 20-yard sight and pointing it at Thomas's feet, and he was probably 40 yards away. Yeah, I was like, oh. <laughs> not not a huge amount of smoke. That's more of a signaling smoke to be, or a marking smoke. It for was sure. a lot of smoke, but all at once. Yeah. I'm winded from my sprints, so we need to do more cardio, Joe. Oh, I'm a man. I'm not even that winded at all. Let's uh, let's run another. So the 37 millimeter market has been really neglected for a long time, and uh, one of the things that we found out from IWA is that uh, they're kind of trying to 
take that market that's kind of been neglected and abused. Most of the companies have only decided to sell to law enforcement um, for all their rounds, including the less lethal stuff. Um, anything non-anti-personnel, that's CS gas, OC, parachute rounds, multi-bangs instead of just single concussions, long-range smokes. Um, IWA is going to launch that. That's something that I'm super excited for. And that means that when you're adding it to like your, your pedo kit for the guys that you can take out, um, you, can, you can really just load it up. and you Excuse can me! They what? actually prefer the term minor attracted persons. No. All right, guys. I know what you're thinking. Yeah, yeah. We're getting we're getting pickup shots. Yes. Um, yeah. Uh, your shorts got shorter. They did, and all I have to say about that is, you're welcome. So yeah. Anyway, we got asked by the nice DNR lady to kindly not shoot grenades at the uh, at the Even public though range. It's literally not a grenade launcher. Even though it's literally not a grenade launcher. So anyway, we're here, we're in a residential area and uh, we figured that what, what better place since we got kicked out of the public range than shoot it in my parents' backyard. And if you're watching this, mom and dad, I know you're on vacation and you're not home. So you're gonna find this out too late. Anyway, guys, this is the grenade launcher. As we mentioned, it, it mounts to other things. So we have it on the good old Palmetto uh, State Armory thingy with the cool sight and it's a vibe. It looks awesome. We got the shocker trigger on that bad boy. Um, it's sick. We're gonna do a quick concussion range test, which you'll see we already shot that at the proper range. Um, and then since we are in a residential area, uh, we're, we're thinking we're gonna try to shoot a watermelon. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna try to shoot a watermelon and see what kind of damage it, it would do. It's not an anti-personnel round. Not at all. Not at all. ATF. Basically the equivalent of a firework Stupid. without the colors. Yeah, you, you still don't want to be near it. It's so loud. Descriptive on this, uh, loud enough to make your ears ring. Yes. Yep. And a little bit of an observational study we're running. We, we're going to see how long it takes for the police to possibly show up. Yeah, my the police says, he actually lives right there. Does he? Oh. Yeah. So, uh, uh, ETA, 37 ETA, seconds. ETA, 37 seconds. We're going to see if we can get away with this. Uh, all right, let's get into it. Yep. All right, guys, so to show that this is not an anti-personnel load, um, I'm gonna put one of these concussion rounds in here and we're gonna shoot a watermelon with it. And uh, I really, really hope that I actually hit this thing straight on. Here we go. Gosh. I was close, little, little bonk. I was hoping for a more direct impact, but it is what it is. Okay, so one more attempt. We've got a crackle round that IWA has sent to us. Um, the thing about our red dot is we don't know where it actually impacts, so I'm just kind of eyeballing it here, but we'll give it another go. Try to hit the middle. Yeah. Oh, I skimmed the top of it. Man, I'm, I'm all over this thing. I just can't hit it dead on. I know, you guys really wanted to see the watermelon explode, so I'm super sorry about that. I know that's not the... Oh my God, what are you doing? Okay, so let's talk about the volume that that is. Um, it's loud. It's like a mortar going off next to your head. Um, it's not pleasant. It's, well, it's, yeah, it's like a firework mortar exploding. You'll notice we wore ear protection. We did. This watermelon's not seedless. It's actually more seeds than I've ever seen in a it's watermelon. It's above average seediness. This was supposed to be seedless, so kind of upsetting. Uh, but yeah, if you're using this to scare off wildlife that are not supposed to be there, like maybe deers in your yard or bears, it'll work. Yeah, it'll or work even the, the average home invader. The average home invader. Imagine you come around a corner and you see that pointed at you. Even though it That's didn't go... like, oh my god, a pirate gun, and then you run the other way. Yeah, and it didn't go like into the watermelon, but... Um, if we hit it dead on, I feel like flapped, it probably would have. It would have gone straight through the middle if we would have hit it It would have embedded itself and exploded it. Anyway, yeah, it thapped pretty hard, so... Um, Bing bong. Yeah, I think that it's effective and it's super, super loud. Like, wear ear protection when you get one of these, because yep. obviously after watching this, you're going to buy one anyway, so... Naturally. Um, yeah, let's move on to the next thing. Yeah, for sure. So I know what you're thinking. Uh, these are not anti-personnel rounds, by the way. This is a firework round that, that Joe found on the internet. But, you know, it's still a 37 millimeter projectile being shot at things. So, Chad, it's probably not going to be much of a Chad when this happens. Don't shoot your friends with it. It's not going to feel good. It's not going to feel great. Well, it's Red Bull pen test time. Uh, it's your guys' favorite moment. 
37 millimeter distraction device. See what happens. I missed, uh, it's because it's smooth bore and it was an undercharged. <sighs> All right guys, closing thoughts. Closing thoughts, HR. Oh, sorry. Uh, absolute vibe machine. Yeah, Everyone needs one in their sick. life. And it's uh, actually something that's like attainable to the average person, I would say. If you can afford an AR, you can afford this thing. It um, is. Go buy one. The most ASMR friendly gun. Not yes. gun. ASMR friendly not gun that we have ever reviewed. This is not a firearm YouTube, so we are telling people to buy this. Um, yes. But we're not promoting firearm sales because it's not, not a, a firearm. real firearm. Woo! Woo! Anyway, uh, yeah, a little bit about this. Obviously, IWA sent this to us, so they aren't paying us for our opinion. He's not giving us money to say good things about this. He sent it to us. He did send us all the ammo, so he funded this entire video, IWA did, uh, which we really appreciate. But he also was just like, if it sucks, it sucks. Uh, if you guys like it, you like it. Uh, he he kind of knew that we... It does not suck well, like, at all. We're, we're professional fun havers, and so when you send us something like this, it's super fun. We're gonna love it. It doesn't suck at all. It's freaking awesome. The noise it makes is fantastic. The shells that you buy, guys, these are reloadable. So you just punch out the rear primer, put in a new right, rear, uh, new primer and uh, powder load and whatever you choose to put into it. Definitely not uh, anything Not anything hurt people. anti-personnel, anything that carries a payload Can't because that. that is very That's bad. bad. Don't do that. There's and definitely not CAD files all over the internet anywhere um, to, to put it, anything like that. I'm totally not gonna print something for it. Yeah, Thomas is not gonna do that. That would because, be so bad. Because it would be bad, yeah. It'd be the naughtiest be thing, don't do it. So uh, anyway, but yeah, we're saving those because those get reloaded. So it makes the ammo for this almost reasonable um, to train with. And on top of that, he's releasing the multi bangs. He's gonna sell the CS gas, the OC, stuff that you actually would want to as a person that a lot of these companies can sell to civilians, but oh, have chose Kurt not Cobain, to because POV. they're boot liquors um yeah that's that's pretty much what he's gonna do we're we're stoked to see where this comes we're gonna buy two more um uh, you guys are gonna buy one and commit coffee you're gonna buy coffee you're gonna use the code deskpop420 and get 10 percent off of that coffee but more importantly you're gonna click the link in the description to check these guys out he also sells those multi bangs that we did you guys know that a while ago we talked about um, that. if you check that one out the distraction devices we already talked um, about it yeah so we don't need to go over it again. You guys know. You guys know the deal. This thing's awesome. That's pretty much it, guys. Thanks so much for watching. And as always, you're watching Disney Channel. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think we're going to get, like, actually in trouble for this?